During the 2008 financial crisis, world leaders at the G20 summit in Washington, D.C. expressed concerns about its potential impact across communities. The discussions highlighted the need for timely information to enable more effective response. Responding to the call, in 2012, Pulse Lab Jakarta was established as a joint data innovation facility of the United Nations and the government of Indonesia, with a mandate focused on exploring and implementing innovative practices. As the first of its kind in Asia, the lab's work was centered on showcasing the art of the possible with big data. Leveraging big data for the public good, its research included conducting social media analysis and real-time monitoring to gather insights to inform policies and practice. Combining big data with traditional data, the lab sought to uncover actionable insights that could be used to address some of the most pressing societal and development challenges faced by citizens, such as food security, air pollution, economic challenges, amongst others. Soon after, the lab realized that its core data analytics needed to be complemented with a human-centered design approach to ground truth insights from its data analysis research. Also known as thick data, insights gathered through ethnographic qualitative research help to answer critical questions that big data by itself cannot. From developing fit-for-purpose tools to coming up with innovative solutions, people needed to be at the heart of every intervention. Applying a mixed methods approach in the problem, solution, and identity spaces, in 2020, the lab began transitioning from being merely a data innovation facility to being an analytic partnerships accelerator. With this emerging identity, its focus shifted to catalyzing connections across the private sector, government, and civil society to support policies and action for effective development and humanitarian practice. The lab's accomplishments not only demonstrate measurable development impact for the community, but also reflect meaningful collaboration across its government, private sector and research partners. With the COVID-19 pandemic bringing data innovations to the fore, the lab's lessons and experiential knowledge combining data analytics and service design became all the more important marked by a growing demand for collaboration, partnerships, expertise, and thought leadership. It is important to invest in systems that are innovative, centered on people, and gender responsive. Such system can then provide the necessary evidence-based insights to support national priorities, the post-COVID recovery, and of course, to accelerate the achievement of the Sustainable Development Goals. From building innovative tools to aid COVID-19 response, to identifying behavioral barriers, to utilizing digital tools for women business owners, Pulse Lab Jakarta's experiences highlighted that a holistic approach is needed to look at the end-to-end -end processes and resources required for services to run and generate value. This holds true for digital transformation efforts today, which must be inclusive to ensure no one is left behind. Driven by the Secretary General's common agenda, the lab's efforts will focus on accelerating inclusive digital transformation through a quintet of capabilities. Data, innovation, strategic foresight, behavioral science, performance and results. With these capabilities, the lab looks forward to scaling its lessons and experiences to help countries in the Asia-Pacific region and beyond in their digital transformation journey towards improving the lives of their people and achieving meaningful development outcomes. Observing the methodological, operational, and ecosystemic impacts delivered through their work, I would be keen to support the transformation of the lab into regional hub to accelerate inclusive digital transformation. We look forward to the evolution of Pulse Lab Jakarta into a new UN Global Pulse Asia-Pacific initiative, working together with other country partners and organisations in the Asia-Pacific region towards improving lives and realising meaningful development outcomes. A stronger UN is one with greater capabilities for data, innovation, strategic foresight, 
behavioral science and results, UN Global Pulse provides exactly this, innovative methods and approaches to help us get there.